Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to be talking about the official Facebook for iPad app. I'm not sure um, when you guys are watching this video, but basically, the Facebook for iPad app has been leaked. The code has actually been included by the developer inside of this updated version of the Facebook for iPhone app. Now, however, there was a way to do this without jailbreaking, but Facebook has blocked it, so now you do need to jailbreak to get this Facebook for iPad app, but I'm going to be showing you how to do that right now. First, you need to be jailbroken, so go ahead and check out my links down there in the description if you need to jailbreak your device. I have links for iOS 5 as well as iOS 4.3.5 and lower. So check that out, um, but basically once you're jailbroken, as you can see I have Cydia installed right there. Once you're jailbroken and have Cydia, make sure that you download the Facebook app for iPhone, as you can see I have it right there. Um, and this is currently what it looks like for me, it's just the classic, let me go down to the classic uh, iPhone app here. As you can see it's the classic iPhone app there, nothing special. Um, so basically once you have that installed, go ahead and open up Cydia, um, it's going to load up here. So then you're going to go to search down here along the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and click that tab. And basically what you need to search for is face forward. As you can see, I'm searching for face forward right there. And go ahead and click the one package that comes up. As you can see, the package says re-enables Facebook's iPad app. So you're going to go ahead and click install up here in the upper right. Click confirm. It's going to install. As you can see, it's reloading the data here. Then you're going to click reboot your device. And I will be back when it is rebooted, guys. Okay, guys, so I'm completely rebooted here. And I'm going to go ahead and open up the Facebook app. And as you can see, it is fully formatted for the iPad. Um, as you can see, it's it's completely formatted for the iPad. It looks very good, very nice. You can zoom in here and check out all of your news feed posts. Um, go ahead and click here, change the feeds. As you can see here, just choose what feed you want. Um, you can check in somewhere um, with this new page. Um, I'm not going to show you my location. Um, you can update your status. As you can see, very, very simple. You can also update photos, see all your photo albums there. Um, if you click this little button here to the left, you get a full-featured pull-out menu there. That's a really nice. It reminds me of Twitter for the iPad. Um, as you can see, you can check out your profile here. Um, this is what your profile looks like. You have all of your content here, very, very nicely formatted. Um, you can share all the information there. Go to your info go to your photos, go to your friends, very, very, very nice. Um, also along here you can check out all your friend requests, check out your messages, check out your notifications um, all along the top, so it really works well. Um, also you can check out your messages, This, hang on, let me go back here. This is what your, uh, it's hard to do behind the camera, this is what your messages looks like. Um, chatting or friends looks very good there. Um, and as you can see, you can also find your friends and sync your contacts. And also you can check out your account settings, privacy settings, and help settings there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and you can search as well. I'm going to go ahead and switch to landscape here. And yeah, overall the app looks really nice, guys. But that's Facebook for iPad. That's how to get it. And that is how you can download it. That's my review. I really like it. And it's really nice that it's finally released for the iPad. Hopefully there's an official version that comes soon. But uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe, rate, thumbs up, and favorite down there. Greatly helps me out so you don't miss any more videos. Also, be sure to subs or visit my website, bookmark my or bookmark my website, like my fan page, and follow me on Twitter, all down there in the description, it greatly helps me out, and also subscribe to my gaming commentary channel down there, guys, um, and yeah, hopefully you like this video, I'll have more up like this soon, sorry it's a little quick, I'm a little rushed in making this video, but it was just a quick review, so it's nice to have the Facebook app for iPad, and yeah, hopefully you liked it, and I'll catch you later, peace.